Hi, we're going to be making our keyboard and computer screen today. Here's the keyboard and to begin you're just going to want to fold along all the score lines and they're easiest to see on the back side of the keyboard. So you begin by folding along all the score lines. This is just going to help you when you're actually folding the pieces together. Just getting all the score lines done first will help. Okay, so once you have that done, you're going to fold up the two sides. And these two tabs down here are going to just rest at the bottom. Then you're going to fold this up over. And these two pieces here should just lock into place. And there's your keyboard. The next step is our computer screen. This is a little bit bigger, so you'll need a little space for this. Now, as you can see, there's a couple pieces with this one. If the black piece falls off, it's completely fine because that's just the insert of the computer screen. So you can set that aside. This part of the computer screen is actually the stand, which you can see here. So this piece you're going to want to break off. And again, you can set this aside. So here's the skeleton of your computer screen. Again, you're going to want a little bit of space for this. But again, you're going to fold along all the score lines. And again, folding the score along the score lines before you actually try to fold it together just helps making make the um, process easier when you're actually trying to put the product together. So once you have that done, then you can take your black piece here and fold the sides. This is just going to give the black part of the computer screen a little bit more stability once it's inside the actual computer screen. And what's great about this is you can print off your own logos and you can tape them to the computer screen. Or if you have a printer that's big enough, you can print out whatever types of messages you want to have. So if you have a different spy theme in each room, you can add a different spy message. Or if you're doing a science theme, you can add a science message on it. It's very versatile and it makes it a lot of fun. So once you have the computer screen folded, you're just going to take your black piece and kind of sandwich it in between the two pieces, like so. Then you're going to fold your tabs down into each other. Take the tab that you had um, pre-folded and slip that inside. And again, you're going to do this on the other side as well. This should just slip inside. And you can see the tab here. This one just folds right in. And if you're not able to get it in, you may just have to um, adjust the black cardboard piece that's inside because sometimes the piece can ride up where you're trying to insert the tab. Which you can see I'm having that issue with. So just hold it down. You can actually just fold it all the way down inside. And then it'll insert. You just have to play around with it a little bit. Then the back of the computer screen, you're going to insert these tabs into the big slits that are there. And just fold that down. And just give it a good, nice push. And it 
it should line up pretty nicely. So you'll know your computer screen's the right side up because our logo is down here at the bottom. So again, you can set this aside for right now. And we're gonna move on to the stand. Same process, you're gonna fold up along all the score lines. This insert piece pops out. like so. And then what you're going to want to do is you're going to fold this piece down and there's tabs and you're going to pop that into place. So I'll do that one more time because it's a little tricky. You're going to have this tab piece that kind of pushes out. You're going to fold the tabs back and just pop that into place. So you can see there's a little tab here. There's also a tab on the bottom of the computer screen. And there's some slits in the back here. You're going to want to loosen those up because you're going to slide this part of the computer screen over the back of the stand. So the easiest way to do this is just to lay it down, insert it in. And as you can see, those two tabs at the bottom that we saw were lined up. And there's your completed computer screen. And if you want to place the keyboard in front of it, you have the full effect. For more information, please visit our website, www.guildcraftinc.com.